Welcome YouTube. It's another one. ACNH. Here we go, baby. Let's go. Um, we are currently. Let me actually check that I set the date properly before stream. God, come on, Wilson. <laughs> I told him not to curse in the first one mi minute of that. Is that YouTube? I love YouTube. Welcome YouTube. All right, so we're um on March, April, not March. We're on April second, twenty twenty, at six a.m. We're getting right into it. I'm very excited. And when I say right into it, I mean right into it for VOD. We've been yapping for so long on stream. If you guys want to watch that, go to twitch.tv slash Um, I was waiting for it. Dude, I knew you would be as well. Because I mentioned it before. Like, oh, I, I, I'll have to wait for your F word to go away before I can start the VOD. But whatever. Ari likes YouTube more than us. Who said that? Ban that guy. Chat, ban that guy. Mods, ban that guy. Chat ban that guy. That's not what Jerma says. Chat, can you ban this guy? I don't think that's the quote. Um, yeah, I don't have mods. Yo, where's Treble? I modded her after last time. She didn't even show up. I she literally said I wouldn't show up that much, and that's like fine. Um, one day I'll get people who are like actually good mods. You know, maybe. Oh my god, I just had the craziest burp. You guys are so lucky. I muted in time. Anyway, hey, uh, she's in clicks stream. Okay. I see how it is, Treble. Um, what I found out after last stream is that... Oh, the toilet one again. Uh, what I found out after last stream, by the way, guys, Bunny Day, it does work. Bunny Day works. So, last time, we thought Bunny Day didn't work because there was a thing saying that in 1.9, it was removed. This is true, I think, from what I remember. To be honest, I looked at it like over a week ago. But this is true from my knowledge. However, in 2.0 version of the game, it got reintroduced where time traveling does give you Bunny Day. The reason we didn't see it is because it appears like the Bunny Day event showed... Hello? Is that real? No, it wouldn't be. Wait, no, it is. Wait, no, you're kidding. Wait, <laughs> no, the game is going down in like th th 20 minutes. <laughs> no way. <laughs> what the heck? I was like 9-4. That's today. I was trying to get conf I was getting confused between April and now. Oh my gosh. Maybe I'll have to figure something else out for the stream. Anyway, Bunny Day starts. <laughs> I was thinking it's Fall Guys time. Bunny Day starts at um eight days before the official bunny day and in 2020 the bunny day was the 12th so it actually starts on the fourth um and we're not at the fourth yet so anyway bunny day is here happy happy we have a new friend on our island let's give a big archie welcome to hans hans okay so what we were gonna do acnh i'm tempted to just pause this vod and restart it like like <laughs> just add this to the front of the next one and just get right into it next time because apparently we can't play uh ellie it says server maintenance for this is happening at like 8 45 or something <laughs> hang on acnh server maintenance They do this every once in a while. Oh, you can't travel online while the servers are down. You should be good to keep playing. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. You won't have any issues during normal play. If you go online, then you might, but even then it won't harm your game. Okay. We're good. We're good. The way it said it, I thought it was going to just be like, hey, your game's shutting down. Shut up. <laughs> okay, so they're just working on like, okay. Ellie and Phoenix weren't going to hop in here anyway, so we're good. Ellie sent me stuff. Oh my gosh. I'm going to express my appreciation for... All that you do for me. That's why I decided to get you this gift. I hope you like your shiny KKDMB. Oh, thank you, Ellie. Thanks, bro. This letter is invisible. It, yeah. I I could see the text. I couldn't see the background. My fake dad. Oh, thank you. Oh, my gosh. All right, let me. Oh, and Gulliver sent me stuff. Thanks, Ty. I'm back to share them with me. Book near about it. Here's a reward. This rare pirate baby is all yours. Okay, cool. Scourge of the Seas. All right. We'll get the Nook shopping stuff in a second. But Ellie, thank you so much. So this first one's from Ellie. Nice KK and D and B. 
A veggie plate meal. Okay, thanks, man. Thanks. Serene painting? Oh. Wait. Oh, gotcha. This is the fake uh, mail. I understand. I understand. And this is from Gullivar. A sea captain's coat. Whoa! That's kind of fire! For the achievement thing. Yeah, thank you, bro. This is fire! I actually really like this. As soon as we get that freaking wand, man, we're gonna look so sick. I really like that coat. Oh, man. Thank you, Gullivar. Alright, let me get the rest of these. We do have to get the prom flooring. I have that written in my notes. We have to do that. Um, so we'll do that in a second. I kind of need to- I need to start making things look nice around my island. Uh, because I have a lot of, uh, things to use for flooring. What's for Cynthia again? Oh. Let's put it right here. But I'm, like, so bad about- Oh, can I not put it- Oh, please. Please. Please! <laughs> I said it again. You're welcome. That's where I wanted it. Uh, yeah, that's that's good. Perfect. Yeah, I have a lot of things just sitting around, and I don't really like. I really gotta figure out what to do with all these things. Like this kick scooter bike, the kick electrics, kick kicking kick kick dot com. Subscribe on kick dot com. That thing. Don't I have a bike somewhere as well? Let's play next to the lawnmower for now. I don't have a kick, by the way, and I never will. Sorry. I'm not a fan of gambling. That's a lie. I would gamble my life away if I had a bunch of money to just throw away. Like, if I had, like, a couple thousand dollars that I was just like, I'm making enough where I can gamble this, I would do it. Just for the funsies. But, like, I would never go past that limit, right? I Like, I would know that that money is going away forever, and I would go in knowing that. That's the best way to do gambling, in my opinion. Which is probably the only good way to do gambling, is knowing that you're going to lose it. Kids, you heard it, gamble. Guys, gamble your life savings away. Who needs it, you know? Your kids for college? Who, who needs it? Teddy Prince said, can, he, I like how we both went to the college thing. Yeah, who, who needs it, bro? Here's the thing. Here's the thing with gambling, right? Everyone says it's so bad because they don't want you to make the profits, you know? They say all these terrible things about gambling because they don't want you to know the secret to a happy, healthy life, which is gamble all your money and you can be rich. You can be so rich. Don't say, see, they're trying to they're trust silence me. You heard them. You heard them. They're trying to silence me. All right, DMB, let me, let me listen to it. And let me check it off in my list real quick. DMB, thank you, Ellie. Appreciate you for that. Uh, Bunny Day does work. I've said that, so let me check that off. Let's go buy the prom flooring as well it's in a second, because that's on my notes. By the way, exclamation point ACNH, if you guys want to follow along on the dock, whatever I do, um, if you're watching on the VOD, you might get spoiled if I do something in a stream that I haven't posted yet. But I, I post the streams to my VOD channel a day after, like, the next day, like, as soon as I can at 2 p.m. So, um, I'm sure it'll be fine. I think I did the math for how many cherry blossoms I need. What was it? 95. I need 95 total. So I'm actually going to grab my cherry blossoms from my inventory right now. Now, we don't have all of the, um, things we need. What are they? What are they called? Someone, someone can, ha someone help me. Help! <laughs> help me! Um. I'll get there. I don't have all the DIY recipes that I need. We can sell these. We don't need these. Again, muted right before, um, a burp. You're welcome. Um. My hair is getting really long. I think I should really trim it. I think it's finally time. I've been avoiding trimming it because I don't know why. I just was like, you know, like it's 20, 25 bucks to cut hair that I'm going to grow soon anyway. So it's just like, why even trim it? But it's getting a little much now. Anyway, anywho, my mom got me like an iron thing for my hair. Uh, I've never tried it, uh, but I'm kind of excited. I was very excited when she brought it for me. She was like, oh my God, look at this thing I got you. Look how cute it is. I was like, oh, thank you. Look, Ellie, I got wallpaper that looks like you. Anyway, um, we need 95 cherry blossoms and we don't, or cherry blossom, pe blossom petals, but we don't have the actual uh, recipes yet. We have one of them. 
Which I actually got to check which one we have because I got to check it off in my list. But, oh, I guess I shouldn't check it off until I actually craft the thing. But, um... Can I sort by order obtained? Should be kind of near the top. Yeah. So we have the bonsai. Where is that? Bonsai. So that's only six petals. Yeah. Um, so we could we could craft it soon. We I feel like we should craft all of the cherry blossom stuff. Um, just for the sake of like knowing we have all of it. But at the le very least... You know what? We can craft anytime. I'm just going to check it off in my list to know that we have the actual recipe. And I will craft all of them another time. We'll just make sure we have 95 petals to craft all of them another time. And maybe a little over 95 just in case. For whatever reason. If a friend or whatever, whoever wants. Um, we do have to look at turnip price. It's been a minute since I played, so it's I'm trying to get recalibrated. Let's go over and check the turnip price because I want to do that first. I believe we spent 94 bucks or something. Ooh, golden tree. I believe we spent 94 bucks. I forgot it opens later. So let's just do our dailies and then we'll check another time. I see a cherry blossom back there. I kind of want to go get it real quick. Yeah, what did we spend? Was it 94 or something bucks on the uh, turnips? Uh, I don't know if anyone remembers. Come here, no! Oh, come here! I feel like it was around 94. So, um, hopefully we, we'll just get lower than that. I don't know if we'll get that lucky. Um, to be honest, maybe if I get like 130 or something, that'd be nice. Oh, I forgot I'm building a bunch of houses up there. Um, we're gonna have to start talking to all of our villagers, like actually. So yeah, if we get like 130 or something, I think I'll sell at that point. I think that's like enough. We might have honestly had 130 last time and I decided not to sell because I feel like that's something I would have done and possibly did do. Um, <laughs> my bad. Who's to say? Who's to say? We can't go back and check and I won't. So again, I think uh, with the trees, I'm trying to think because look, look how many cherry blossom trees we have. All of these are non-fruit trees. So I feel like we should, I, like it's good to have these cherry blossom trees. I also think we have way too many. So I think after cherry blossom season's over, we're gonna try to get a little more situated with our trees. We're gonna try to get like five of each tree, maybe. Like five of these hardwood trees, five of me. I don't know if there's like a softwood tree. I don't know if that's how it works. Uh -huh. <laughs> I almost choked on my breath. Um, but you know, we'll try to do something like that. Um, Cause I don't like how many trees we have. Um, partly because Isabel doesn't like it and she will take stars away if you have too many trees. Like, you should have some, but you shouldn't have too many. Um, so partly because of that and partly because uh, shaking all the trees takes forever and I don't want to do all that. The only thing is I don't know how the cherry blossoms spawn. I don't know if it's good to have this many trees around right now. But, um, yeah. That's the plan. I'm feeling good though. We have, like, um... We have a really good setup and I went through last stream. I think I, yeah, I went through and I wrote down all the fish, all the insects, everything that I need. Um, some of them start at 8 a.m. So we will time skip today depending on like what time of day we want to play at. But for now, let's just do all of our normal dailies and, um, and then we'll see. Doing my 2,437 before bed push-ups and I fell asleep and had a terrific dream about a DIY idea. I got so excited I couldn't even work out so I wrote this letter. Now go use it. Go, go! A bamboo wall decoration. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Lee. Okay. We don't have bamboo yet. Don't know when it shows up, to be honest. Not 100% sure. I'm sure everyone's sleeping right now, right? Oh, this guy's awake. Oh, this guy's not awake. Oh, he is. He looked like he was falling asleep. Let's talk. It's size? Uh, this reminds me I was supposed to work out today. And I didn't. Because uh, like I said, I'm free Saturday now. So I pushed my workouts a little bit. Whoopsies. It happens. 
Um, but you know, no, my muscles won't look so small. That's ah, just a common one. I don't remember what any of the butterflies look like, and I need, but I think they only show up at eight anyway, so I shouldn't really be catching anything right now. But we have to find some. I got the gold. Oh, uh, I did the golden tree, but let, I'll check it off in my dailies when I actually get the um the thirty thousand off of a tree. Uh, let's look around for. Ooh, pink tulips. Let's go. Do we have those yet? I don't think so. Yeah, that's our first one. I love seeing when we have new, um... Jesus, I got the burps right now, because I freaking... I always eat dinner right before, and then when I just start talking and talking and talking, then it's like... My, my, my burps just come up, they're like... Let us out! You know? Um... You know how, like, when you're, you know, just hanging out, and then your throat screams, but you didn't do it? It's like, it's screaming for help. Anyway... <laughs> Anyways. Yeah, we have a lot of trees just sitting around. And some of them are money trees, which is why I'm also being as careful as I can. Because I can't just start chopping stuff. That's another thing. I want to start putting all the money trees in one section. Just dig them up, put them in a different section. It's just easier that way, isn't it? I think you can do that. I'll have to check. Actually. Um... Because having them all in one section... Because wouldn't that be cool where you have a row of money trees and they're all different growths, right? Because we break them down after they grow up completely. So they go like in order of growth. And then when you chop down the last one, you plant a new one there. And then the growth like kind of move. It shifts every day because, you know, because you keep moving the trees. Wouldn't that be cool? I think that's the vibe for what we do with the money trees. This guy's gonna be home. Hello, Ons. How you doing, bub? I don't like this guy. Oh, I can't actually talk to him. I forgot that when they first move in, you can only talk to them like about moving in you can't actually be like hey let's have a conversation let's talk let's be friends can't get any friendship points with them just yet <sighs> sorry about that um so another thing i was thinking about is with the villagers like i said i want to try to get every single photo card in the game which will take ages and ages and ages a lot of grinding to get that um but i was thinking about that and i was like you know obviously i'm gonna get villagers along the way who i like and i want to keep so what do i do about that so i'm just gonna keep everyone i'm like a hundred percent about keeping. like shino is never going away because everyone in chat loved her i love her so we gotta keep her but like renee i was iffy about so i don't mind losing her to switch her out for another villager that can get me photo cards and just, we'll just hope that we don't get all 10 that we really, really like before uh, we're done, hopefully. Morning! A super yummy smell woke me up earlier than usual. It was like a breakfast ghost snuck into my house. Okay. Oh, we got five times for that. Let's go. I'm excited to talk to Pascal again. It's been a minute since I talked to him. That silly little guy. I mean, for him, it's been a day. <laughs> for him, he spent long enough away from me. Now he's just craving his next shell and he's like, it's time. But for me, it's been like over a week and I miss him. I miss that silly guy. <gasps> There's a hermit crab. I didn't know they come out this early in the day. Aw, go out to see little guy. Oh, well, go out to see, little guy. Oh. Oh, okay. Just disappear into the void, little guy. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, Never mind. Yo, we haven't seen the money tree yet. Not 100% sure where it is, bruv. Um, our trees are still growing. Looking good, looking good. Our pear trees are all done, at least. Again, we will rearrange those two. <laughs> 
because it it doesn't look it doesn't look good how it is right now. It looks okay. It looks a little bit overwhelming, I think. I'd rather have them just in a straight strip, like a straight line. Um to make it easier to see all of them and pick all them up. <gasps> Cherry plus. We're just gonna keep getting these because we need 95 of them. I had to clear my throat. <laughs> um, I it was so aggressive the way I cleared it, and then I have like such a little, um, just joyous like laugh, like hey, <laughs> like a little giggle. But though, if you guys heard the shift from that aggressive throat clear to just <laughs> it would have been great. Anyway, um, what else was I thinking about? Yeah. So another thing about the balloons, they come every five or ten. Like right now in the game, it is. 638 so they should come in two minutes so we're gonna keep an eye on the balloons too because those are what give us the cherry cherry blossom diy recipes um and like i said we need what was it 13 let me check 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 and we already have one so there's 15 total we need 14 more so um so yeah we gotta keep an eye on those balloons because we only have like 10 days, I think, to do that. And, you know, obviously... I mean, I can do it off stream if we're done with April by the 10th or whatever, but I don't think we will be done with this month by then. Like I said, I'm only playing off stream when, when, the, when there's nothing left to do and I just have to grind out the dailies on... like, off stream. Because that's something that no one really wants to watch necessarily. There's a fourth fossil. Very nice. How have we not found the money tree yet? Is it just in this last corner that I haven't checked? Or did I miss it somewhere? Or did we not plant it for this day? I'm sure we planted it. This is why putting them all in one area would be really nice. I should probably do that soon. Did we accidentally break it down when we started building all of these houses? It's very possible, actually, that we did that. That is not... Ooh, that might That might be what happened. To be honest, we did build a lot of houses and things. Let me look at the map. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, yeah. Could be in any of those locations. Um, oh wait, could it be up here actually? Because we haven't actually looked up and you can't see the leaves from up here. Or from down there. Uh, it's not here. Yeah, I might have accidentally just killed the money tree for this day. Uh, when I was doing... All this building which is okay that's not too bad i mean what is it 30k lost i guess 40k lost because we planted 10k that went away not the worst what time is it 6 40. Uh, apparently it changes day to day what side you get um the balloons from so uh, we've had so this one might be the next one actually that grows um we I, I remember a lot of balloons coming from the left side, but let's just keep an eye on it. And whenever we see another one, we will see. Because I could honestly just sit by the pier and watch them around, you know, when time, when it's about time for them to show up. I think that's what I did last Cherry Blossom. I just would sit down, like right at the, um, right at the beach on the left or right side. I just wait for the cherry blossoms to spawn. Or for the uh, recipes to spawn, the balloons. And I'll just shoot them down every time until I got all the recipes. I mean, really, there's no reason not to. Or there's no reason to. Because when we play, we'll see it. But if it gets too close to the end of the cherry blossom season, we'll just grind it out. We'll get the last recipes. Because again, we do have to play a lot, like we have to get through a lot of days, but I don't know if... Um... Thank you, Bladders. Um, I don't know if... Um, we're gonna make it all the way around to April again, you know? Oh, we gotta give the fake painting as well. Let's do that in a separate one, just in case. Here you go. Only one free one, or one new one. Which, by the way, let me just... Check this off on my app before I forget. The anom Anomalocaris. 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 Thank you. By the way, uh, if any of you have 
all of your fossils done already. Only do this if all of your fossils are done already. Please. Um, don't feel obligated to do it otherwise. But if you've done all of your fossils and you have no reason to do them anymore, and you have a bunch of unassessed fossils, please mail them. Please mail them over if you want. Uh, that'd be real nice. Um, because I can assess them over here. You can't mail assessed fossils, but if you mail unassessed ones, I can assess them over here and be like, Oh, is it the one I want? And then, you know, potentially it will be. And that would be nice. But no, no, no worries if not. But, you know, thought I'd throw it out there. Alright. Um, alright, let me check through my dailies. We have done the mystery bottle. We have done the golden tree. We've done the four fossils. Let's run on over to Asale Boy. Well, first of all, ooh, there's new clothing. Oh, first of all, let's talk to Nana, who's out tonight. Chat with me. Okay, cool. I asked you to talk to me, and you said talk to me. So, what's up? I want to ask you about location. For store everything you've opening. Yes. Let's do it, baby. Let's do it. Finally. We can get some new clothes. We can get Ellie's merchandise. We can put our own merchandise up as a code if you guys want it. And we can start working on our style, which honestly, Cloud said this as a joke last stream, but I'm going to take it seriously. I can work on my real world style using this game. Because it'll give me access to a bunch of new clothing items and names and things that I would never think about if it wasn't for the game. So... I'm pretty happy. I'm pretty, pretty happy. Let's drop you. I feel like you would be nice back here somewhere. Maybe, maybe just back here. Maybe just like right, mm, right here, right here, right here. Let me see what trees get removed. Hmm. Let me rethink it. I don't want. I don't like removing fruit trees. I don't know why. I guess cherry trees don't even matter that much. Um. But it's kind of a big shop. Can we put it like here? Again, let me imagine it. Cause that cherry tree back there, I don't want to remove. Potentially. Okay, I'll take this. This is good. Let's do it. Very nice. Cool. We will obviously rearrange everything. I want to make this place super blocky Minecraft core. Like, I don't know why. I just want to, like, terraform it to be a square. <laughs> Especially because, like, every single building is a square. So it'd be nice. I don't know. I just want to work on this place a lot more. I can't wait to unlock terraforming and stuff. But I've never done that before. That is something that I never managed to do in my old save. So I can't wait to see it. Wait, is there anything else? Oh, I can I can look on sale. Zen's playing. I wonder if she's in chat right now. <gasps> Trench coat. Caveman tank. That's kind of funny. Kind of want it. We have steel toed boots. <gasps> Heart shades. All right, well I want to get these. Um, speaking of socks, because I see the socks there. I bought some Deadpool socks at Five Below when I went to New York. And, um, they're kind of fire. I really like them. I kind of want to get more, like, interesting socks. Like, ones that aren't just plain black, white, or gray. Um, because right now, those are the ones that I have. But now that I have them, now that I have, like, these nice, like, well, not nice. They're five below socks, but, like... Now that I have these kind of silly little socks that, like, are actually interesting, I don't want to wear them unless I have a reason, you know? Like, if someone's going to see them. Like, I'm not going to wear them out because no one's going to see my socks. So now they're just sitting there waiting to be used. Like, when I go, like, to see my girlfriend or my girlfriend or whatever, like, at her place, then it's like, okay, like, I'm going to be wearing my socks and she can see them. But... Getting more inquiries about the camp that you help build.
Okay. So as we work together, I'm sure we'll reach our goal of having Kiki hold a concert here. Dreams do come true. Thank you, thank you so much. I'm more determined than ever. We're not done, sexy boy. <laughs> We're not done, sexy boy. We're all counting on you. Are you ready to talk about the next part? Come ask me. Okay. Ooh, a nice little rusted part. And a velvet stool. Ooh, Hans. Throwing away some interesting stuff. Waiting for visitors, okay, but maybe you're interested in a more proactive approach. You can use Amiibo. Okay, well, shut up. What's up, Zen? I saw you just launched ACNH. Welcome, bro. Okay, well, I have no Amiibos, unfortunately. So... Oh, that's... Okay, cool. Unless anyone wants to mail me an ami Amiibo, I'm not going to be using that ever. I'm going to make a little note for myself to buy all of these DIY recipes, but let's see what the Imperial Fence and the... I feel like we have both of these already. Imperial and Log. Log we have, Imperial we have. Okay, I was right. Let me make a little note to myself to um, buy Nook Mile DIY recipes. At some point. We don't have to do it now. We don't have to do it anytime soon because it's kind of expensive, but we should get all of these at some point. Especially this one because we're working towards that slowly but surely. Is there anything we want here? New eye colors don't really care. Body paint don't really care. We have a good hairstyle that I'm cool with. New reactions. Did we, did we get this? Let me check real quick. New reactions. I didn't. Okay, let's get this. I wasn't sure if this was something that goes away or if it just sits there after you buy it. So I didn't want to spend another 3000 if we already done it. But no, this is something I didn't check off. How's it going, bro? It's going good. It's going all right. School just started for me yesterday. Um, I'm actually going to, after stream today, get like super organized with it. Like write down everything. Get a whole planner set up. Just do all that smart stuff. Um, oops. Not what I meant to do. Oh, uh, dang, we got a lot of new ones. Oh, shyness is kind of cute. Let me, oh, well. Let me just register another one because I don't like that there's something not registered there. Sure, let's do that. You're planning? Slay, like, yeah. I, um, I've gotten better and better about planning. It's, like, been a growing thing, right? Where I used to not plan anything and I would forget that things occurred. Like, I, f I would forget that things were going to occur. Like, I remember, like, last christmas or something or last thanksgiving or something i went to see my family like my uncle and uh they would ask like everyone was asking me a bunch of questions like they do when you get together and i couldn't answer any of them and my my uncle pulled me aside and he's like have you are you high <laughs> or like have you been like smoking a lot like what's with your memory i'm like no man i'm just like i'm not organized i don't think ahead because i just have too much going on that i don't figure out what i have to do or what you know like uh, like there will be like a stream that i had set for like like the dodgeball stream that snuck up on me and ellie's uhc kind of snuck up on me but thankfully i was smart enough now to organize and put it on my calendar ahead of time so even though it snuck up on me i had it sitting there so i didn't plan anything over it you know but i used to not do that so i would just i, I couldn't answer any questions like oh are you free this day i have no idea last christmas are your birthday reference i did go there for my birthday i, go, I did go see them it was very nice. Um, although it was a last minute thing, so nobody like got me Christmas or uh, birthday presents really, but that's fine, guys. That's fine. Uh, we were supposed to buy this, so let's buy this real quick. What's the A button? There it is. Prom flooring done. Let me check that off in my list. That was something we wanted to do last time that I couldn't. Um, I don't remember what's happening ever. That's the thing, and I felt so bad because it was wrong of me to. Sorry, I think we already have rag time. It was wrong of me to not be able to give people a proper response. Do we have rag time? We don't. Okay, that's a new one. Let me place that order. Let me check that off. It would be so, it would be so bad if we got two duplicates in a row. Um, like, I felt bad not being able to give them straight answers, you know? Because they're asking me these questions. They want to make these plans. They want to do these things. And I just can't do it. Like, I'm just... I, I'm just... I'm not thinking ahead, you know? And it, it felt horrible. Because I was just like, all these, you know plans seem cool they seem a lot of fun like we can do all this stuff if i actually get it together enough to do it anyway now i've gotten way more organized since then um let me just check off 
in my dailies real quick. We did the bulletin board. We did the KK record. We did the recycling bin. We'll shake the trees soon while we wait for the thing to open. It's another hour till it opens. Maybe we time skip a little bit forward. Maybe I should do it to seven instead of eight. <laughs> Welcome back, Wilson. Uh, I'll talk to Nook in a second because he did ask me to ask him what we should do. So we'll do that in a sec. I just want to get a little bit of stuff out of my inventory. Um, anyway. Yeah, so I've slowly been growing my organizational skills. I made a planner to like plan stuff because it's at first I didn't have a planner. So that was just insane. I don't know how I did anything without a planner. But I think that was only for a couple weeks. And then I was like, I need this thing. <laughs> I need to have a planner on me. That's insane. Such a bougie stool. Such a nice. Stool. Is bougie? Bougie means like real rich, right? <laughs> no, wait. Am I mixing it up with another word? I might be. I have a planner, but I forget to look at it. So I plan all of my stuff on Discord. I have like the planner. I have a bunch of stuff. I'm right. Okay, cool. I'll just assume I'm right. I don't. Th I don't think I got it, guys. Uh. <laughs> nope. Didn't mean to favor that. Oh, I forgot to give this to Blathers. Let's do that in a sec. All of this is to be sold. All right, let's go. Let's go give this over. Um. So. So yeah, I. What was I saying? Yeah, I made a planner. Uh, something new that I'm doing this semester that I picked up from my girlfriend is to um put every single thing that you like go through the syllabus for your class. Go through every single assignment they say that we're gonna have. Put that. Put the date in like. Google Sheets, which I'm not gonna use Google Sheets, but I'll put it in like a separate Discord channel in my like private server and just have everything sat there so that even like no matter what, like I have my normal planner and then I have what's coming up, like all my upcoming assignments. So I can keep that in mind. Like, oh, I have a test on this day. Maybe I should start studying if I have free time. I have a group project. Maybe I should get a group together to make sure I'm ready. Group projects stress me out, man. In college, come on, get it together. Even though it's meant to teach you for the real world, but still. Um, but yeah, that's the plan for tonight, actually, is to figure out literally all of that stuff. Um, and just have it all written down for me. It'd make me way happier, too. Yeah. What? This is a fake! I cannot accept forgeries, so I must take it back. Okay. That is as we expected. So we can get our Nook Mile points. Let's go, baby. Did you get hoodwinked? <laughs> okay. I'm gonna turn off the AC. It's getting cold in here. Cool. Um, but yeah. I'm feeling good though. I'm I'm feeling really good about like all of the organization and stuff that I I have been doing and that I'm going to do because um it's just all gonna allow me to get a lot done up up and coming stuff that I need to get done. We can uh, honestly hang up this painting, this serene painting. Oh, uh, actually, we could mail it back to Ellie, right? Ellie, are you in chat? Do you want it back so you can use it for your Nook Mouse? Oops. Oops. Oh, you get two and then it leaves. Uh, I think I'll need a... I already did my... No oh, you already gave him the fake painting? Okay. Then we'll hang this up. No, I did it. I did it. I gave him the fake. He he let me keep it. So I was like, do you want it back so you can use it? Or what's the vibes? But I'll hang it up. A little reminder of you, you know? Unless you want it. Ooh, it looks it fits in nicely with this stereo. Keep it sick. Look at that. That's very nice. Very nice. Alright. We also have uh the two bears here. We want to get the other bear inside at some point. Uh because it will help our overall score with the homeowners association <laughs> with the Happy Home Academy to um have three bears all together as a set i think so we'll, we'll bring this guy inside soon 
Mm -mm -mm. All right, let's shake some trees, baby. Let's shake some trees. Let's shake it like it's hot. That's not the term. <gasps> Hello. Oh, you know what? We have to keep our net out anyway for the wasps. So let's just keep our net out for these two. Uh, apparently, we have to catch five wasps in a row for a thing. So we're gonna also hope... We're gonna actually hope that we get wasps for once. Because... I mean, that won't be a hard one to get because of the way that I do these um, tree shakes. I always have a net out, so I'm not too worried about that one. It's a very easy thing to get. Okay, a little bit of money, I'll take it. Please! No, I'm trash! I think I already did this one. I think I already did this one, but I'll do it for safety. Rather than have to circle back. Alright. Our luck from last time has gone away. Where we got... <laughs> where we got it first try both times. And there goes the net. Dang it! Sucks because I literally see a cherry blossom to my left, but we will have to go make this new, new silly guy. Oh, I do have to hit rocks at some point. Too. Anyway, next time we'll start the um the day at seven a.m. or eight a.m. We could do eight. I don't know why I don't do eight. I guess. So we don't ever have to wait for the shop to open. I just did six just in case because I was trying to think like what I needed to get done. So. Uh, that's not what we need. There we go. How many sticks do we have? We have 30, okay. I like keeping sticks just so I don't have to go and search for some. It's not often that you really have to search. I don't know. I'm just lazy. Cause it's like, if you go home and you're like, you almost can make the thing you want and then you just can't, it's annoying. <gasps> We've duplicated a black rose. Very nice. Oh, the money tree was here. Okay. Alright, uh, we'll go get the axe, so we can break that down. Okay. I forgot that there was one just sitting right by the flowers. Very silly of me. Alright, let's go get an axe real quick. And just put it away, because I thought that we didn't have it. Should've looked a little closer. I'll have to check what other trees there are. Because there's hardwood trees, I don't know what else there is. I could check in the shop, because I know they sell some. But I don't know if they sell all of them. That's also one of those things that, if I'm being totally honest, we probably don't need every single one of them. And we don't need five of each, probably. But it's a nice thing to have. There's no reason not to, I feel like. Server maintenance starting. Shouldn't be an issue, though. real it says 9 p.m they said it was like 8 55 so they lied to me okay. very nice now catching the five wasps in a row i wonder if that goes day to day Let's see what this is. I'm not even gonna look. Okay, I think I already have one of these. Let's go check. I'm pretty sure I have one. Unless it's a dryer. Because that one was a washer, I think.
Yeah, okay, cool. <laughs> Great. Sounds like this is getting gifted to someone, probably. Okay, this can go back away. This can also go away. And we'll put these away for now. Again, we're going for 95 cherry blossoms. We are currently at 19, so we've got a ways to go. Um, I believe, like I said, it ends April 10th. I think I might have it written down in my doc, actually. Events? Nope, I just don't... Why? Great. I don't know why I didn't put the dates. Um, also, there's supposed to be Nature Day at some point um, in April. I'll have to check what day that is. Oh, let me check off my dailies again. Uh, it was just shake trees that we did. Let me hit my rocks. And then we'll water some flowers. I actually think we should water flowers last, because it's possible I push forward a little in the day and it starts to rain. And at that point, I'm not gonna water. So I think that should be like the last thing we do of the day before we move on. It also gives me a chance to think if there's anything else I want to do before I end the day. Because I, I end the uh, the day in game sometimes and then I realize, oh wait, there was another thing I want to do. It's too late now. So, we will try to keep that in mind. Oh, capture memory. I can do that. I can't wait for Animal Crossing 2. I mean, I guess not 2, but like whatever the next one is for the Switch, like for, for Switch 2. Um, and I say that knowing that I still have all of this game to go, plus the DLC for this game, which I've never played. I don't even know what it's about. I don't really know what to do in it or anything. So we still have a long ways to go before we get to that point. Um, but yeah, I, I still, I can't wait. Just to see what they do next. Like, what the vibes are, you know? Like, it's not gonna be an island, probably. So what are the vibes gonna be? Like, are we gonna be mayor? Are we gonna be a resident representative or whatever? Um, a lot of cool stuff that could come up. Also, because the um, Animal Crossing mobile app's shutting down. This slingshot, I've been using to the recipe. The only one I've made just broke. Congrats! That means you got, what is it, 25 sling uh, balloons, right? I think I can check. We checked this last time, I think. Hmm. I actually want, I, I know I don't need to check that bad, but I kind of want to know now. Oh, it's raining treasure. Yeah, 25. Hours broke after 25 as well. We need a balloon to show up to see which side it comes from. I see a balloon. Or not a balloon. Sorry. Got you guys excited for no reason. I see this guy. There we go. I'm really happy when I get to just play this game on stream. Uh, but yeah, uh, I was gonna say the Animal Crossing mobile app is gonna come out soon. Well, when I say come out, as in the paid version, which is like fully done, like you can 100% it without any, you know, online features, I assume. Cause they're shutting down maintenance for the other one. So I want that to come out. I want to just reset progress. And I just want to play from the beginning with that. And I can do that on my own time. So I don't need to play with you guys. Um. And I just want to play through that as well. I like 100%ing things. What can I say? And Animal Crossing is such a fun game to 100%. I also got 100% other games too. I'm currently... I have not played Danganronpa in a while. And that was another game that I was planning on getting through. So I got to do that at some point. But I've just been sitting and not doing it. Because I haven't had time. 
I, I'm worried that on Saturday or Sunday when I have like free time, instead of doing all the other stuff I want to do, I'm going to just play. <laughs> Which is still good. I'm, I'm cool with getting through another game. I haven't, I have not. Yo, 2024 has been a bit of a dry year in terms of beating video games for me. If you guys look at my like true achievement score, it's real low compared to the past. Um, which I'm not complaining because I obviously, you know, I got a girlfriend at the beginning of the year. <laughs> I got a girlfriend at the beginning of the year. Well, started talking to her at the beginning of the year. We weren't like dating the whole time, but you know, um, I did February and then, and February was good. You know, that was a lot of gaming. Um, and we've done, I mean, I've been streaming a lot. We've been doing a lot of events. I guess it's just been difficult to play games. Like, I just haven't been playing games that I've been actually getting achievements in, I guess. Um, like I said, I'm not gonna water, but I do want to move these into the right positions. No! My shovel! I'll go get it. I'll go get a new one. These are roses, right? Yeah. Pink roses uh, are not needed. F wait. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. <laughs> no, I got it. Okay, so I need an orange flower, which red and yellow make, to put here. And then orange and white have a chance of making a special red flower. Um... And the two special reds go here, and they make blue. Okay. That took me a second. Also, blue roses, I think, are... You've been together longer than I thought. Well, we've known each other for that long. We've not been dating that long, um, necessarily. But we were super close. <laughs> oh, about four times. Yeah. Uh, we've been super close since we met. I don't know. We just really, like, immediately got along. Obviously, because now we're together. Anyway, um... Yeah, I get it. I understand. Blue roses are apparently some of the hardest things to get. <laughs> ever. Ever, ever, ever. Okay. This is all good. Um, okay, so we're good on all of the flowers at the moment. I was making sure they were all pr properly in place at the, uh, as needed. Uh, wandering NPCs, we've talked to them. We need to talk to all of the villagers, so we'll go around and see who's home, who's not. Uh, and then we'll push forward into a little later in the day. And when I say a little later, it's going to be an hour into the day. Because um, we literally didn't need to push that far forward. We just... We're a little bit silly, and that's my mistake. Um, so first, let's check Renee, see if she's up. Sleeping, okay. Let's go check out Chino. We've talked to Nana, we've talked to Hans, we've talked to Alfonso. Let me check how many people we have. We have one, two, three, four, five, six. So, uh, we've talked to Goose, Alfonso, she, uh, not Chino. Nana, Han, so it's just Renee and Shino that we have to talk to right now. I know I could add more bridges. Maybe I should. I don't know why I haven't. I know I could. And I could add like a proper ladder too. I don't know why I haven't. Hello. What you up to? Garden wagon, yo! Garden wagon! Yeah, show me, please. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, this chair, I don't know if I mentioned it. I might have already mentioned it. They're fucking expensive, they are. Um, I don't know if I mentioned already, I might have. We got a new chair. Do you know, you know how I was talking about how I hate this chair? So, okay. I had my gaming chair. I look dress sporty. Um, in my spicy little wetsuit. Whoa. Guys, I think she's flirting with me. 
Um, <laughs> I had my gaming chair, which you guys have known for the past few years. The leather on that was starting to rip off and it was just going all over the ground and I had to keep like cleaning up the ground around me. So I put that downstairs in my dad's office and stole one of his chairs, which is this one. But this one's super squeaky, it's old, it doesn't feel comfortable, I can't- like, I sit, like, I just sit, like, not normal, right? Like, I sit, like, with my legs up, I sit, like, I can't sit, like, a normal person in a chair for that long. And I think there's a lot of people who are like that, like, I'm not saying, like, oh, I'm so quirky. I'm just saying, the way that this chair was made can't sit like that for a very long time. So, um, I just hate it. So, um, I've been- we- started looking for a new chair we found one at bj's that we were like all right let's go at blowjobs that we were like let's go you know take a look so we went and it was unfortunately they didn't have any for display so we were like screw it let's just buy it right because the, the re reviews look good like the fact that we went to go look at it in person means that it's good enough that we wanted to buy it assuming we could try it right and if we can't try it then there's nothing else we can do like we it's, it was the last step. So we, we were just like, let's go get it. And uh, it's sitting downstairs right now. I haven't had a chance to, like, I got it this morning. I haven't had a chance to actually, like, open it or anything. But hopefully, hopefully, fingers crossed. Maybe tomorrow, maybe very soon, I can build it and I can uh, use it. I'd like for it to be done before tomorrow's Fall Guy stream. Which I haven't actually put on the schedule yet. I probably should. I'll do that tonight. Um, I'll officially make that a real stream because I do want to do that tomorrow Ellie if you're here just so you know it's official you can join my stream tomorrow for fall guys um Ellie was on stream yesterday telling people that I was doing the stream even though I was like not uh <laughs> even though I was like not 100% sure if I would do it but now that I've done this stream and I feel good and I feel like ready I think I'm good to do tomorrow's I haven't actually played fall guys yet in the new season so it's kind of perfect because the main challenge we're trying to get done for Fall Guys is win eight knockout games. Which is not impossible for me. I had to burp. Oh, these are the starts. Okay. I was going to say, did we have trees? Um, Just sitting here? I thought we... I was like, what the heck? Oh my god, the poop hat. Let's go. Um. Anyway, what was I saying? Um... I have I have won a few knockout games in my time. Like I did my dailies for a long time and I would win games pretty easily. So I do think we could win eight games. That's something it really is something. So I, I do think we could win oops uh eight games potentially. I hate everything right now. Why can't I wasn't this all sorted properly one day? Did it? Did I ruin? I don't know what I did. There we go. Jesus. All right. Hardwood and uh, iron nugget. Okay. We have a lot of iron now, and we have a lot of stone. Some of this we might have to just get rid of. If I'm being completely honest. It's just that you can only get so much a day that I don't like removing it. Uh, maybe we just stop getting more potentially, but we, you know, we just try to get the money rock and then we move on. That might be the play. I don't know. Anyway, uh, yeah, I, I think we could get at least a couple wins in knockout tomorrow. We probably won't. This is one of those challenges that I'd love to do the entire event in one stream like we normally do. Um, but they've been making it more and more difficult to do that, like to fully do an event in one stream or in one sitting in general, which is smart, right? For their, their brand or whatever, like they want people to play more. They've been like sponsoring YouTubers. They've been making a real go of like getting people to play now, which I am happy about because I wanted Fall Guys to make a comeback and to actually be played <laughs> for people to actually play it. Um... So I'm happy about that. Um, but you know, we'll see. I'm unsure what the wave is gonna be. Let's push forward. We're gonna push it to 11 a.m. I think. Um, so it just crosses over to 12 on its own and then we can check the new turnip price after that. 
Um, but yeah. So I don't know exactly how tomorrow's going to go. I Ellie, how far did you get with the event when you did it yesterday? Because you streamed for like two and a half hours, right? Uh, and I'm probably going to stream for... I don't know. Three to four hours? I can't tell. Is that freshwater goby in the tank by your house? It is. Three or more? Okay. You did three or more, and how far did you get? One win. Okay. What about all the other challenges? What about all the, all the other stuff that exists? That I, I will also mention it's super sweaty because you were playing day one. Why are you crying, Phoenix? What happened? Because Ellie's trash? It makes me sad too. <laughs> You are halfway through the other challenges. Okay. So yeah, again, I probably won't do the entire event tomorrow. I think it'll just be a fun stream to do to be like, hey, the new events, like the new season's out. Like I said, I want Fall Guys to succeed. Um, they've pissed me off a lot in the past. I'll be honest. They've done a lot to make me upset over the course of multiple seasons and things. But that's just how you, what you'd expect from a game that's been going this long. And from all the ch changes that they have to make after getting acquired by a bigger company and all this stuff. But that being said, I've always had faith in them. I've always wanted them to make a comeback. I've, well, I told Ellie, I either want them to die or I want them to come back. Like, pick one. Don't be in this middle stage. I want you to either fully die or to fully make a comeback. <laughs> and I think they are making a comeback. So, um, all right, first things first. We actually want to go talk to Renee before I forget. And she's up! Let's go! A lot of the new rounds are awesome. Let's go! I did see some of them. I had your stream open. I didn't want to spoil myself too much, but I did have it open so I could get the rewards for watching. If you guys didn't know, if you watch Twitch Fall Guys for 30 minutes, you can get two rewards. 15 minutes for one, 15 for the other. Well, 15 for one, 30 for the other. So you get it continuously over the course of 30. Um... Okay. I don't like your sailor's tea, actually, Renee, so I'm gonna see if I can get you new clothes, just so you know. Okay, bye. We've talked to our villagers. Um so yeah, Ellie, I've uh, I've seen some of the new rounds because of you, and they do look pretty sick, which is very exciting. Let's go see what the turn of prices. Uh, that's not what I meant to do. Great. Great! That's like way under. So, no, I'm not gonna sell. Cool. That's a lot of money. Uh, now we do wanna check. Real quick. Uh, there it is. There's cedar saplings and normal saplings. Hmm. I'm trying to think. Maybe for the trees, we'll wait for leaf to show up. Let me check what what kind of trees there are. Let me if I search it up right now. What trees are there in a sage? <sighs> Not all trees grow successfully due to p poor soil quality and placement. Okay. If the player stands on a tree sapling at exactly 6 a.m., the tree will grow around the player and knock them out as though they had been bitten by a tarantula or scorpion. Dang. There's cedar trees, which are the ones we see up top. Hardwood trees, which is the ones we see down here. Fruit trees, palm trees, which we have. Money trees, which we can see sometimes. Golden trees. Word. Appear only in the original Animal Crossing. Okay. Dead trees only appear in New Leaf. Bamboo trees debuted in New Leaf. They can show up in Animal Crossing New Horizons, but we haven't gotten them yet. 
can be all. Oh, they can be found on the Mystery Island tour or received from ba Daisy May. Okay. Um, in New Horizons, when you shake trees, there's 15 bell bags, five beehives or wasp nests, and two furniture two furniture leaves. This number varies according to the total number of trees in the town. Okay. Interesting. So you can get two furniture leaves apparently, but you need to have more trees in the town, which we don't want to have. We want to have less. Okay. So we're going to just keep, we're going to try to, well, yeah, we're going to try to keep it to like 10 trees maximum and hopefully that'll give us everything we need, right? Maybe not 10. 10's a little low. No! Okay, apparently it's not two hits. It's just after you try once, it'll speed up until it zooms away. Silly leaf. Okay. Very interesting. So yeah, after cherry blossom season, we'll maybe... Maybe we'll put like five on each section of the island. Like if we look here. Like we put five on this top left area. Five in the bottom left. And maybe five in like that middle patch. Probably none on the right side because the right side has a bunch of fruit trees on it right now. Um, but we only put like a couple maybe so that we see them around. But it's not too overwhelming. Five of the hardwood is what I mean. And then the cedar trees, we can put like a couple up top and that's it. Because that's where they stay anyway up top. I don't like that jumping guy. We can go swimming now. We can go get Pascal's stuff. Uh, we can, um, let's put the 99 away and let's also mark off that we sold shells, weeds, and fruit. We have to start selling more fruit. Um, that's partly why I want to figure out the tree stuff now, sooner rather than later. Potentially today, it could be good just to have it a little bit more sorted. Um, we'll have to eat a lot of fruit to start moving stuff, but... Could be good. No, I was, I, I don't know. I wait so long to hit A because I'm like, I'm not sure this is the right option, but I only noticed after hitting A that that was the wrong option. Insane. Anyway, let's do a nice 99000. Drop that in there. Drop that bad boy in there. Um, I like, I don't know why. I like it being a round number. Sorry, I gotta check my phone real quick. Hey, how do you guys, uh, th what do you guys think about the Minecraft movie trailer? Everyone's crapping on it, and all I'm saying is let it be silly. Let them make silly movies. What's up, Fanny? How you doing? Let them make silly movies. I don't care if Minecraft movie looks bad or good. What I care about is that it looks like they had fun making it, and I'm gonna have fun watching it. And that's all I care about, okay? That's all I care about. We're doing times three, so this... Uh, sorry, give me a sec. I'm doing math to literally figure out how much to take out of here to give me myself a nice round number. I want it to be a multiple of 99,000. Um, two, nine, three. Yeah, I'm trying to make it a multiple of uh, 99,000. So every time I just deposit 99,000, it looks like Spy Kids 3D. Was that which one was Spy Kids 3D? Minecraft making a movie? Yeah, they just released the first trailer today. Or teaser today, not trailer, sorry. I always mix the two up because I don't care that much because I don't watch trailers or teasers. I just watch the movie. But, um... Where did that emote come from? <laughs> 300 IQ, let's go! Um, look. Spy Kids was a good series. That was a good franchise. Don't know what the new one was like. I don't know if that's the one you're talking about, Spy Kids 3D. I don't know. I just know Spy Kids was good, Okay. Until the new one, but I don't know if the new one's good. I haven't seen it, but I know that the old ones were. And I know that this is a very silly movie. I also think that I, maybe it's, again, this is something I've been saying in Discord and stuff where I know that I 
had an obsession with Minecraft for years. It is a part of like my core like childhood. So I'm going to have a strong reaction to the movie and I'm going to be annoyed when people hate on the movie teaser, you know? Like I get it that I'm going to just have that differing opinion because of how I grew up loving this game. But it looks so silly, I'm gonna have fun. I don't care. I'm gonna have fun. It, it's like, we watched FNAF, right? That was some stupid stuff. Watching a stream in a VOD at the same time makes me feel like I'm at one of those parties where everyone's talking once. Why are you doing that? Why? <laughs> there was no reason to. Okay, we finally got the star thing. All right, let's see what Isabel has to say. It's a hundred percent movie you watch as a kid and love it, and then you'll grow up and hate it in your twenties, like the Fantastic Four or Spy Kids. Yeah, I remember. You're editing something that makes sense. I remember I watched the Fantastic Four movie, and I was like, "This is not bad." And then I saw everyone hated it. <laughs> Having a headache and neck ache, bro. Go get some rest if you need to. You don't have to be here. It's okay. <laughs> you don't seem like you're having a good time. I've always wanted a task force of my own. Let's talk on the house. How am I looking? Conduct random polling. The better the balance of natural beauty de development decor, the more stars. More residents and buildings, proper infrastructure, and a well decorated natural setting. Oh, f f wow. <laughs> I thought I'd at least have like two or three. Okay, they don't want it to be famous. We focus on growing our population, okay. What are y'all's core memory movies? I never watched movies really as a kid. See, like, Spy Kids 3D is a core memory for him. That's why I'm like, I don't even care if it's bad, because I am just letting my inner kid just run the show, you know? I'm like a Disney adult, but for Minecraft, and that's really sad to say, and I understand that's sad to say, and I'm disappointed in myself, because I make fun of Disney kids all- or Disney adults all the time. But, um, it's Minecraft, man. I'm not gonna show up wearing Minecraft merch or anything, you know? I'm not that guy. I just want to go see my silly Minecraft movie with Jack Black, Jason Momoa, and Danielle Brooks. Shut up. We're going to be fine. It'll be fun. All right. Danielle Brooks killed it in Peacemaker, which is all I know her from. Apparently, she's also in uh, Orange is the New Black, which I never watched. But she killed it in Peacemaker. Okay. So I don't, I'm, I'm not too worried, man. I'm not too worried. I feel like she's part of the reason Peacemaker is what it is. So. My mom's going to sleep. Let me just say my good nights. <laughs> I'm trying to be a better. Uh, I'm trying to be better about texting on stream, as in I want to text more on stream because I feel bad when I just go a a wall for like three hours. <laughs> so I'm like, maybe I should say like good night and like check my phone a little bit. See, you, I used to stop doing that because I would be unprofessional if I checked so much. But now I'm finding a better balance where I check sometimes, but I don't like constantly. Let's go, um, let's go sea creature hunting. But like, I also used to care more about like, oh, you know, I want to seem professional. I want people to watch my stuff. Now it's just like, I want to like... I want to make some good stuff, right? Just because I like making stuff, but like, I also want to care about the people around me in my real life. So, I don't mind, you know. Damn, I'm really lapping up this water. Do you see me opening my mouth? Nom nom nom. But yeah, I, I don't mind, you know, being a little unprofessional to like, be able to talk to the real people in my real life. 
That's fine with me. I really watch movies either, but I love the air. Airbud movies were good. Spider Verse is not. There's no way you were a kid back then. A certain Pokemon one and a handful of others. I'm trying to think because it's hard for me to name any movies that I watched when I was younger. But I did watch some movies. I just didn't watch many. I've been watching them more because my because I always say my girlfriend. If you guys don't know like her name, but because Barca, her name obviously. It's because Barca and her family watches movies, so I go with them now. And I've like I went watch Deadpool with them. Um, and then I watched Deadpool when Elias and everyone came here. And it was fun watching with them too. I would just lean over to Elias and I'd go, you're gonna love this. <laughs> like, I did that like three or four times when we were watching Deadpool. I was just like, I, like he was, he and Lane were in a, like a little, cause it was like those things where like two people have like right next to each other and then there's a bigger gap and then two people. So him and Lane were there and me and Risco were here. And I would just like lean across the, <laughs> across the thing I go, you're gonna love this. <laughs> and I lean back. <laughs> that was really funny to me. And like, uh, I would always look over for everyone's reactions whenever something happened. Because I'd already seen Deadpool. So like, I knew everything that was gonna happen. So I would just lean over and I, or I'd look over and I'd be like, what are, how would they feel about this? It was a good movie. God, I want to watch it again, actually. I can't wait for it to come to Disney+. Plus. I assume it's coming to Disney+. Plus. Um... I actually have to watch a lot of Marvel stuff. That's like on my to-do list. Like I said, I have a lot of things I want to do. Some of it important, some of it more recreational. Well, which, which is important. I guess I shouldn't say it like that. Some of it urgent and important and some of it important, but not urgent kind of, you know? Like I do want to get through Marvel and be able to keep up with pop culture and stuff, but I haven't seen anything since like Doctor Strange 2 until I watched Deadpool. Which, I don't think I needed to know anything from the past stuff to enjoy Deadpool. Yo, Deadpool 2 was- or Deadpool 3 was confusing though. Cause they- they make a reference to the end of Deadpool 2, but they retcon some stuff and it makes it real confusing. Anyway, I won't get into spoilers too much. I mean, I feel like we're past the spoiler mark. You know, in my group chat, we're not allowed to spoil things, even though- like, with some of my friends, we're not allowed to spoil things, even though it's been, like, over two weeks of the movie coming out. And it's like, when you've gone past two weeks, the spoiler warnings are done. You, you, you should have watched it if you cared so much, you know? How did you watch with two different crowds? Uh, because I went twice. What do you mean? Fanny, you know that they, like, don't, like, they don't arrest you if you go to the movie, if you go to the movie twice. I went, I went twice. I went with, like, Barca and her family. Um, and then when Elias showed up, so actually some scrub who has not been in my chat in ages, but who used to be, um, he wanted to go because he hasn't seen it yet. He is the reason we can't talk about it in our group chat because he hasn't seen it yet. Um, so he wanted to go. Uh, so, and then Lane wanted to go. So when Lane showed up or like everyone showed up, I was like, yo, let's go watch this movie. And then some scrub was not free. Um, so the four of us went, um, and it was still a lot of fun. It was great. I would go. I would go again. Probably not anytime soon, actually. I don't watch. I rewatch stuff twice. I rewatch stuff twice, and that's it. I must say I'm very out of touch, but I think I've thought about Skibidi. Okay. Okay. So when I say out of touch, I mean like with actual like real people, not like with Gen Alpha. You know. <laughs> I mean like with the real like actual human beings. Um. So you know, the ones with the rights. <laughs> I, um, I can rewatch stuff twice. I can rewatch stuff once. I can watch stuff twice. And then I get, and then I'm like, it's done. Like everything I watch, I watch twice mostly. Well, everything I watch that I love, I watch twice just to get all the new, like when I go in knowing what's going to happen, I can kind of understand some of the new aspects of the show that I missed the first time. So I like watching stuff twice just to get all that stuff in my brain hole and know what I'm, you know, know what I'm going to see, you know know what's gonna happen, know how the characters are gonna act and stuff. So I like doing that. But after twice... After twice, it's too much. Uh, I barely understand what is, it is. My mind just went so It is kind of a silly word. Uh, didn't gen alpha culture result off of influencers much older than them? Yeah, but that's always how it happens. You know? Mostly. But they're the ones who chose to like that, like it so much, you know? They're the ones who chose to, like, watch it so much. That's a new thing. Okay. Sea pineapple. 
Move all your move, sea pizzas. Let me... Where's my sea creatures? Sea pineapple. <gasps> Let's go! Woo, woo, woo. Uh, we still have to get a lobster, which we can theoretically get now if we get lucky. Alright. Let's go, dude. Let's go. That's exciting. Very nice. We will go drop that off in a bit. When I think Skibby, I don't think the pop culture thing. I think of an inside joke. That's also fair. And I'm not even one to talk. I, I don't really keep up with pop culture enough to, like, you know. I know that Matt Pat's made Skibbity th toilet videos or whatever, like theories about like, oh, it actually means this interesting thing about like the Lord, like whatever. And I'm sure it is. I'm sure it's got something interesting to it. Um, and I don't mind weird, silly, like, listen, I'm from, I'm from just younger than the age of YouTube poop. So I was like right around there. That stuff was so dumb, you know, that all of that stuff is like, it's all, it's all a bit silly. It's easy to crap on Gen Alpha, and I will continue to do it until they learn to be a better generation. Or until they grow up and maybe, hopefully, get past all of the horrible ways that they have grown up because of social media, you know what I mean? Like, a lot of me crapping on Gen Alpha is because of stuff like the internet being in their life the entire time and all these like family vloggers who like put them on YouTube all the time. Yeah, that's the thing. They didn't choose it, but it's like the some a lot of time when I say stuff against them, it's not even their fault. But it's also they do act a certain way because of it. That's oh, not good, you know. Like I have talked about it multiple times. I think at this point where I've been like <laughs> crapping on Gen Alpha. And it's partly just because, you know. Oh my god, that's a big one. <laughs> I mean, I don't know why it looked so much bigger than normal. Yeah, yeah, like you can't blame them. But at the same time, they're acting a certain way, and I'm gonna like call it out, you know. They're just cute little kids. I know Gen Alpha kids, and they're the worst. So I'm gonna throw that in the ring too. <laughs> Shout out to my cousin. Let's go. <laughs> I hope he sees this when he gets older. He won't. <laughs> it's gonna get lost to the world. Um, and also, if he does, hopefully you're better now, you know? Cousin the Ace. He was at my house for way too long. <laughs> for weeks. And I was losing my mind. They're their own people. Yeah. Well, again, it's different for every section of the generation like you can't really categorize an entire generation into one thing but the issue is that a lot of the generation like a big issue with some aspects of the generation is red the fox calls you cousin in this game yeah i'm actually roasting red right now um a big issue with a lot of parts of the generation is you know, like, there does exist a lot of stuff, and it is due to, like, social media and stuff. Let's go! We got our shell. I also see, I think, a large uh, sea creature up top, so I'm gonna go get that in a second. Here you go. They say the runners can get a second win, but, like, what if the first one's barely even a breeze? That one feels like it could actually be kind of deep. What did we get? We got a pearl. But yeah, anyway, I feel bad talking about Gen Alpha all the time. Because at the end of the day, it's like not their fault. Partly. I mean, mostly. Oh, he looks so cute. Swing it, swimming over there. Such a cute little guy. Alright, let's get out of the ocean. Let's donate the thing before I forget. Because I feel like I will forget. Oh my god, you see him just tapping the shell back there. Right, this is not a big one. We will only check if they're large because there is a lobster that we want that is large. 
Um, but on our way back, let's just see if we see any large ones. This is large. I think. It could be medium. Yeah, okay. It was just a crab. It's going kind of slow anyway. I think the lobsters are fast. Do I have a worm? Could have just been the waves crashing. But I thought I might have also heard a balloon. Like on top of it. Maybe not. I'd love to see one though. What time is it right now? 11.25. So it is possible. Like it is the perfect time for one. You know, if one were to just happen to show up right now... Hey! Okay, let's do it. I'll place that down for her. Somewhere here, maybe? Kind of a pet peeve of mine when people speak on behalf of their own entire generation. It just doesn't feel nice to me that someone from one place can have. Yeah. Oh, you can turn it on. I guess I, I understand what you mean. Like I said, I mean, yeah, like it's hard to speak for the whole generation. Um, I more just talk about like when there is <sighs> like. When there's one identity, like, I guess with millennials, well, with Gen Z, I guess the whole identity was that you don't care about anything, right? And with millennials, it was the identity of, like, wanting something better than what you had, kind of. Like, we, like, growing up in a, in a way that you kind of hated what you were given, and you wanted it to be better, kind of. Um... Sorry, Blathers, I don't care. <laughs> um, but with Gen Alpha, it is like you have to also understand that, like, with tech being such a big thing for this new generation, it's going to have side effects, and those side effects are not good. Um, like, even if there are good Gen Alpha kids or whatever, and like, even if the majority are good. There's still a lot of cases of, like, teachers, like, literally quitting because the kids are super rowdy and raucous and they don't listen to anyone. Like, they, you know, they grew up in a certain way and she gave me that garden faucet because she bought it here. God, God, come on, Renee. Be better. Sorry if it sounded salty. I don't know how my tone is coming off. No, I get you. I understand what you're saying, I think. It's just a discussion. Just, I, I don't think there's any saltiness or anything. Did I? I think that's all fine. Okay. Um. But yeah, I don't know. I do feel bad because I'm sure there's a lot of good Gen Alpha kids. Like, th this is another thing of like, when you group people together and you do it on the internet, it kind of sucks when people grow up a certain way thinking a certain thing um gotta go for a bit okay no worries have a good one um because there was this um there was this time in like high school like during quarantine i remember we were doing online classes and um in english class i had a group with all oh, I think, yeah, I think it was like my sophomore year, so I was still kind of, I was still pretty young. Sophomore year is what, four years, five years ago now at this point? Um, or I guess it would be like four and a half years because it was like the end of sophomore year, which is when COVID kind of started. Wait. How did my class? Yeah, yeah, I'm right, I think. Anyway, that was completely besides the point. I was kind of young though, like I was, I was younger. So, you know, I was still kind of... I feel like 
I was malleable to other people, kind of, you know? Um, and I remember that, um, what am I doing next? Before we continue, maybe we just go to the next day? Well, we have to wait till 12 to get the, um, um, to get the turnip thing. So maybe we can just catch some fish or something. Let me check what fish we got. Or insects. There's moths, there's butterflies. There's a giant water bug. There's a flea. Okay, there's a lot of fish we can go for. So we're gonna start going for them. We'll go for the golden trout, who's on the river cliff top. Anyway! I remember I was in school. Also, I think we're gonna go a little short today, just because I wanna do uh, a little bit off camera um, and get us to bunny day. And I also wanna try to get all the DIY recipes that I can. Um, Cause I feel like getting the cherry blossom DIY recipes is kind of grindy and maybe not as fun as the rest of this game. As, of this game. So I might just like go balloon hunting on my own time, you know? Um, and I might push forward one day because we're on the second right now. So I might do the third on my own time. Uh, cause the fourth should be bunny day, I believe. If I did the math right. I'll check 100% and I'll make sure that I've only gone up to when bunny day begins. Anyway! <laughs> Jesus. Let's go, uh, get some bait while I talk to you guys. No, oh, a little bee. Oh, wait, do we use our ticket, maybe, and go to the other island, potentially? Maybe that's the play. Let's go do that, actually. Because we do have another ticket, and we could get fish much easier on the other island. Um... I'm getting distracted so easily. As, as is the usual for me. I'll tell the story eventually, I'm sure. <laughs> I'll, I'll get through it. Um, so, I have hair in my face. Uh, I was in English class with a bunch of, you know, it was a group of four boys. And, great. And uh, we were asked kind of a question about masculinity, I guess, or about men. And, um, you know how English classes where you have to, it's kind of like a word association game, essentially. Like you are just doing all these, um, things like you're trying to associate words with different words to kind of get a good grasp of what the story is trying to say or whatever. But for masculinity, everything that we said was, oh, we should go to work at some point. We should start that. I don't know when, I don't know when would be a good time to start that. Maybe when we get bored of the main game. I don't know. Um, and we, we just said a bunch of things that like, you know, masculinity is like scary, like, um, whatever, like it's, it's not good, like it's dangerous, it's angry, it's things like that. And I remember our teacher who was a man came into our, um, breakout room in Zoom. And he, he was like asking us like, do you guys see yourselves as that? Like, you know, you're saying all these horrible things about masculinity, but you guys are men or you guys are boys, I guess. But you know, we were treated as young adults. So it's like, you guys are men. So do you see yourself as, you know, dangerous and angry and like all these horrible things? And we are like, no, of course not. But like the general idea of masculinity is like seen as this horrible thing. And um, that conversation just made me think about like when i grew up and i started to think more about stuff like that like about my experiences in life i started to think about stuff like that where i was like i guess you know things like the andrew tates of the world and like the sneakos and all these guys who like make boys think these horrible things like young boys think these horrible things it kind of sucks that they have so much power because the boys are hearing kind of not great things on the internet otherwise. 
And like, this is coming off in a way I don't mean to come off, where... Like, I don't think we're wrong to say all these things, right? Like, there, there's a lot to talk about in terms of gender or whatever. But, oh, I wanted the big one. I forgot I would get scared. Damn it. Um, you know, like, there's still, it's like, I'm not saying it's wrong to talk about, you know, like, oh, you know, men are scary and there's like, at night, there's all this stuff. You put on lonely and non-confident men or people who already think that way and need validation. Yeah. But, like, the thing is they prey on lonely and non-confident men, but then they also prey on boys, is the problem. Like, the, when, when they prey on men, it's kind of, like, less easy to be, like... Or it's, it's less difficult to be, like, oh, man, like, that guy's an idiot. Like, you know, he fell for it. But the thing is, there's so many, like, especially with Sneeko. I remember there was, like, Sneeko uh, went out to, like, some con or something, and a bunch of boys like young you know tweenagers went up to him and starts spouting all of the horrible stuff that he would say on the internet they would spout it back to him and he was surprised he was like oh my god i can't believe they're saying these things in public and it's like yeah you taught them that and it kind of sucks because when you're on the internet i feel like you get into these echo chambers where you either hear horrible things about being a man or you hear things that are meant to make you feel more powerful in a negative way, right? Like, there's there's people who are on the internet who they express their masculinity through, you know, being a good dad and a good husband and a good, um, you know, brother and, like, all these things. Like, you know, there are ways to express it, but those are less... What's the word? Like, less exciting, I guess? But it just kind of sucks when, like, you know, again, the non-confident men or whatever, like, it's like, you're a man, you're an adult man, okay? If you express your anger towards yourself or whatever on someone else, like, that's not that other person's problem. Like, you, you can't blame women for your downfalls, right? Like, and that's what a lot of those men do. But for boys, it's different where it's like, they didn't they didn't grow up being told the right things i think which kind of sucks and this is kind of the the main way i was trying to bring this back around to the other conversation was like it's kind of the same thing where you like talk shit about gen alpha and like i even feel bad doing it sometimes because it's like a lot of those kids are not ipad kids you know they're they, they grew up properly like they grew up with actual like personality i guess <laughs> like it, they aren't just what media makes them to be so it kind of sucks when they're just told all their lives like i mean it's the same way like millennials were told all their lives that they were lazy you know gen z i don't know what gen z's told i can't really think of anything off the top of my head but you know i feel like gen z does not matter that much um but yeah i don't know it's just interesting that's why i kind of like obviously it's i hate tate for the and like sinico and all those guys for the very obvious reasons there's a there's a man here what are you what are you doing here hello um i think i can actually grab him and put him on my island in one of the free spots which maybe i should do i think all right i'm gonna have to finagle my way i think i have to there's no easy way for me to make a barrier where i don't so i think i have to no wait i can make a thing here yeah and i think that should be good we will actually grab that guy because we want to fill up our houses so that we can get our uh, photo cards i thought this was gonna be all eight. Oh my gosh it was a lot though uh, what was my point though? My point was, I I feel kind of bad for the, the the kids who are who kind of grow up and they don't know any better, you know. I feel we should break these rocks just to get the extra stone. Again, it doesn't matter that much because we have so much stone anyway. But why not, right? It'll at least clear up a little more path as well for us if we want to move around and do stuff. Because we're gonna stay on the island and we're gonna go fishing and stuff. Big fish. 
I want to kind of get it. I want to try to get it. Even though there's... I don't even know what fish I'm going for, but... He's here, so I'll go for him. I might have to go to the other side, which means he'll probably despawn by the time I get there. Look at me! Look at me when I'm talking to you. Okay, well, that's fine. Let's see if we can kind of go to the other side without scaring him off. Okay, perfect. I'm gonna focus. There we go. Oh my god! Why did I think it would be anything else, to be honest? Let's be real here. Why did I ever believe that it'd be anything that was worthwhile? I hate the basses. I hate them so much. I hate them so much. Why would you add them? Get rid of them. We'll try for the golden trout. I feel like that's like the big play right now is getting that, getting that bad boy over here. Yeah, I don't know. It's I like analyzing conversations like that from when I was younger and seeing kind of stuff like that because it is interesting, like, the idea of, like, oh, you know, you grow up as, like, a kid and you're, you just kind of think of your, not even, not even necessarily think of yourself as a bad person, but just see all men as, like, bad. And it's like, I guess it's fair that not all of them are. Like, our English teacher was, like, the sweetest guy alive, you know? There was no reason for us to, like, necessarily say that, but that's just... I don't know. It's an interesting conversation, I guess. It's weird. Hello. My triceps come true on my island? Alright, let's, let's invite him. Well said. Tank. Do I have tank on my list of villagers, actually? I feel like I might. Jock. No, I've got Kid Cat, Kevin, and Pig Leg. Okay. Cool. Good to know. At least we, uh, at least we got him on our island now. Uh, again, we're not gonna keep him. We're just gonna get his card and then try to get him out of there. I think, like, it's gonna be two pretty big missions after this series is over. One is gonna be getting- Welcome back, Fanny. One of them is gonna be getting every single villager's card, every what f photo of theirs, just for the funsies. And then number two is going to be somehow- I hate you. Somehow, we're gonna have to get back all ten of the- Um- of the of the villagers that we want in our main uh, island somehow, so it's gonna be a bit of a struggle, I think. Run away! Run away from me! Run away! Run away! Run! Run! I'm hello. Are you not scared of me? Okay, I guess I'll catch you then. You'll be a good Pokemon for my. For, to fight for me. I'm gonna throw you in the ring with a dog. Look at me! Oh my god, bro. Thank you. He caught on. Freaking cart, man. There's nothing interesting. Do balloons show up here? They do, right? I don't know when I'll get one. You were gonna make one and then I got it first? Let's go. It's funny. This could be a good place to grind out the um, DIYs as well, if I'm being honest. Yo, guys! Look! How much do I have to run around for you to get scared of me, huh? What do I have to do, huh? What do I have to do? 
Be scared. I hate this. I hate this because I'm trying to get them up top and they just won't go. Because that, that top section is not that big, if I'm being honest. It's not a good place to get the trout. We both stole your brain. It's funny. Um, maybe let's let's see what other fish we can get while we're here before we try to leave. Uh, killifish, the smallest in the pond. Okay, so we check pond. There's a hair just in my freaking face, going up my nose. Not going up my nose, but getting really in my way. Um. Oh, the guppy is the smallest in the river, and it can show up from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. Same with the Neon Tetra. There's some that are the smallest in the sea. Oh my god, that scared the crap out of me. Thanks, Anarch. Appreciate you. And medium in the sea. Okay, so we'll look for all the small fish, because there's a lot of small fish out. Because I don't think I'm going to go to another Mr. Island today. I think I want to end by like 11 latest. Because again, I do have stuff to do for school. Um, and I'm going to stream tomorrow, which was not planned until I found out there was like a Fall Guys event. I guess I should have known. I, I guess I should have known there'd be a Fall Guys event. Oh, is this new? Let's go. Clownfish. Let's check that off. Clownfish? I don't remember uh change change Ari's voice. Oh my gosh. I uh I don't remember if there was like uh like you know like uh like I don't uh I don't know uh I don't really actually remember what I was gonna say if I'm being honest. Um Yeah, so like basically If I were an Animal Crossing fish, what would I be? I think you might be a great sea bass. Dang, Fanny, she's like, Fanny, like, hangs on to one joke and then just runs with it. Am I right, guys? Like, bro. <laughs> I maybe should have, like, known. <laughs> this is what I was trying to say earlier, basically. Maybe I like should have like known like uh like that there would be an event because there's it's possible that there was an event for like every single fall guys season recently. That being said, I like have not been like playing that much, so maybe there wasn't like a new. Maybe there wasn't like an event in all of the recent. I hate this guy. In all of the recent uh, uh, Fall Guys seasons. Because I think they actually like retired those things like a lot, you know? Like they kind of like kind of gave up on them a little bit. Well, that being said, I was not prepared for that event, so. That added like an extra stream this week that I was not planning on doing. <laughs> Thought it. And that's time. <laughs> uh, there's your two minutes of that, whatever the hell that was. Congrats. You're welcome. Enjoy. I'm glad there's a bunch of small fish because they are, I think. I don't know if they're necessarily... I think they are easy to catch. Like, I... I think just because they're small, they immediately are easier. What the heck? Alright, I'll go for that in a sec. I want to go for this one. What the heck? <laughs> they're avoiding me! Come here. Oh, that's a little too far. I don't know if... Oh, I lied. I just can't get anything right. When I think they're going to get attracted, they don't. And when I think they won't, they do. I don't get it. Oh, he's so wriggly.
And the fact that you didn't realize, like you thought I was just yawning, that's so funny. Got a Neon Tetra! Let's go. Let's go. Let's go, baby! Yahoo! Let's put a cherry here just to mark that these are two separate fish. Let me mark off the Neon Tetra. And let's keep going. We're gonna get rid of... I think we're just gonna keep fishing for a while. How how big... The river fish are all small, right? Very large in the river, but that's after 9pm. This is after 9am to 4pm, which is... The smallest in the river. I don't think these are the smallest. These are just small. We need some small ones in the sea. We need a butterfly fish. Don't we already have that? I thought we already got that. Oh, sea butterfly versus the butterfly fish. Jesus. Okay. Okay, okay. Oh, this is a big guy. Do I need any big guys? I think I need a medium-sized one, yeah. I don't know if this one's large or medium. That was a bad toss. I think this one might be large, though, if I'm being honest. Red Snapper! I like this one, too. This guy's very silly. He looks real edible. Get scared of me! I am accidentally moving stuff on my watch. We will keep checking up top just in case a golden trout shows up, but I really don't think we'll get that lucky. Or anything golden trout shaped, I guess. Um, okay, so we want smalls in the river. We want small and medium in the sea. I don't know if the river mouth counts as river or sea or both. This one's medium. It'd be nice if it counted as both. Oh my gosh. That was stressing me out. God damn! I was just a freaking squid! Ugh. Associate red snappers with Etho. Because he goes, oh, snappers? Ooh, there's a lot of fish in the pond as well. IRL Animal Crossing Challenge? That'd be crazy. Just a loach. Now we do have to pick which one we want because we will only get one of them. It's possible that we get the big guy if he doesn't get scared off. Um, I think the little ones will get scared. Yeah. What is this? Oh, a new one! Killifish! Let's go. And there goes that guy. Anything else we want in the pond? Oh, the golden trout only shows up after 4 p.m. anyway, so we shouldn't even be looking for it. That's fine. Uh, oh, we have a perfect amount of sticks to make a new fishing rod. Let's go. Breaking a lot of tools today. excited to just do dailies on my own and try to grind out the cherry blossom DIYs. Um, I like doing stream stuff, but I feel like the, the DIYs and stuff will just be kind of like something I can just chill and do. And I can show you after. And then we can just get the cherry blossoms we need for everything on stream. Got an anchovy! This is... Is this a large? This feels like a large... What size fish are you? Why don't you have a tag on you? That's definitely not medium. But I'll go for it anyway because it's big. And you know we like him big in this channel. Okay, cool. Never mind. Remember how much you love Koroks? I don't know what that is. You know what? I'm releasing this guy. I'm releasing this guy. Like some of these, I just, I don't want them in my inventory. Releasing this guy. Mm. 
Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of Loaches. Easily Korok fight? I really don't know what... I don't know what that is. I'm like... I'm trying to think. I feel like I know the word. Why are there so many small fish out this summer? This this day. I feel like a lot of the fish that got added this season are small. Also, the fish we need could be that river fish upstairs too. It doesn't have to be down here, so we'll we'll catch that one because it's any smallest river counts, I think. Like, any smallest fish on the river counts. Like, even if it's river cliff top. Oh my god. Oh my god. Say a little leaf. I thought it was Zelda. Again, not a Zelda guy. I would love to be. But Breath of the Wild just didn't do it for me. So I need to try again on a different game. And maybe go back to Zelda. Or go back to Breath of the Wild another time. That's the smallest over there. Fish, okay. Got another Nemo. Speaking of um, catching stuff, by the way, we have an event. We have a fishing tournament, tourney, on the second Saturday of April. That's another thing to look forward to. We have a lot of events coming up this month. I wish there was a way to just have different stuff in a way like I, I wish I could jump I don't know I wish I could jump from day to day without feeling bad like the whole point is to play one day at a time but I wish there was a way where I could play you know play the, the day of nature day and play the day of the fishing tourney and only play those two days but then that requires skipping around a lot and I just I don't like doing that too much because to me, that defeats the purpose. At that point, at that point, I can time travel and do whatever I want, you know? I could have gone back way before 2020, maybe, and like, whatever, you know? I don't know. I, I don't like that that much. This is smallest. Ah, oh, just a tadpole. I don't know if we're gonna get anything else, but I will take these three that we got. That's still very good. And we'll keep working towards it. This might not be smallest. I keep somehow uh, doing stuff on my watch, even though it's not touching anything. Maybe my hoodie's touching it. I just keep hearing buzz or feeling buzzing. Anyways. I should probably keep an eye out for butterflies, but I did just break all the flowers. I should have probably kept them until the end so that the butterflies I wanted would gather around the flowers. Anyways, too late for that now. That's a big boy. I do not need that big of a fish. But what's nice is we can do like the nature day event or the fishing tournament event, and then we can go and do whatever else we want. I already forgot what I said. You should and you should. I already forgot. I I already forgot what I said. <laughs> what was it saying? Oh, that's the smallest. Oh, 
Um. Uh, oh, that's not a new one. I thought that was a new one. We already got the goldfish. Dang. I forgot we did that. Um, yeah, so... I... I do like that we can, you know, do the nature day or do whatever, and then, like, at night that day, we can just go fishing, we can get bugs, whatever. Like, we don't have to go too crazy. Um... So that's kind of nice. I'm a fan of that. So maybe those streams will be shorter streams, but I do want to do all the events on stream no matter what. I'd feel bad if we didn't. Be what I need, be what I need. Ah. Try buying it online last year, but seriously, the three rounds weird. It might change multiple, charge multiple items. Hmm. I'm an idiot. I lost a streak again. Ah. That was very silly, man. Whoopsies! Super excited for the new Zelda game. It seems very different. Is that that's the one where you play as Zelda, right? Like real Zelda. Yeah. Okay. And I think that one's isn't that one more magic based? Kind of something like that. items around to solve puzzles sort of deal. Okay. To me, that's not what Legend of Zelda is. Like, just from my outsider perspective, like, that's never been what it... Oh, that's a big fish. I kind of want to go for it. It's probably going to be a freaking another bass, but I'll go for it anyway. Expiration Dungeons. Okay. That seems fun. Like, to me, Zelda was a lot about the fighting and stuff. Like, the... Swords and yeah, there it is. No freaking bass. It was always about like the swords and like the gems and like or rubies, rupees. I say ru I say it wrong, but I said it wrong. Um, but yeah, I think it'd be fun to try to play that. Maybe let's just take a quick picture. I never take real pictures. I don't know why. Like, maybe I should, but I just never... I'm never bothered. That's not the one I wanted! No! Okay, thank you. I wanted the smaller ones. It gave me the one fish I didn't want. I don't even mind losing a streak for that. That's great. Whatever. I'll take it. Oh. Let it go. I don't even care. We'll leave soon. Because it's past 12 in the game. So we can... Um... Oh, that was a medium. We could have actually used that. Um, we can go and check out the new turnip price and see if it's better. It's great. A stone. You know, that is... That is a fast... Sea creature. Or not fast one. That is a big sea creature. But it's not running anywhere. Uh, it's kind of running, but barely. We still want the lobster at some point, but, um, oops, it was going too fast. I 
keep thinking I see a balloon and it's just his stupid red t-shirt. Come on, tank. Get it together. Tighten up, man. Can we talk about Zelda and Sword's Armor this one moment? Okay. I'll wait. I'll patiently wait. What are we at? We're at two hours. Okay. Well, we're at like two and a half hours, basically. Because I yapped a bunch at the beginning of the stream. So, um... Yeah, I am thinking I'm going to get close to ending time. Because... I got other things I want to get done so that I can have um, time to... Honestly, so I can have time to make stream better. Because that's what I want to do this weekend. <laughs> to just work on some stuff behind the scenes that I haven't been working on because I've been streaming. <laughs> that's a new one. It's not a new one. I lied. Let's swap it though. It could sell for a little more than like a... Carp. Anything else, boys? Otherwise, let's head out. Ooh, I do hear a balloon. I think. I think. A chance. I feel like I'm going crazy. I feel like I keep hearing balloons and they don't exist. What time is it right now? 12.05. Why don't they exist? I thought I heard one. <laughs> Crying right now. That's not medium. I don't think this one's medium. Let's try. Yeah. <laughs> Should've known it. This one's smallest. something new it is not i think we're slowly running out of steam for this fishing adventure that's a medium fish be what i want what i really really want oh i did not adjust enough i thought i adjusted more than that I love when I just start rushing and I just throw it like six times in the wrong spot. Do I have class tomorrow? I do. I don't know. I keep thinking it's Thursday. And it's not Thursday yet. Uh, I, okay, I'm glad I hit swap it. I wanted to, I wanted to keep that guy because he sells for a little more than a freaking black bass. Ah, black bass. So um, we're gonna sell him. Again, this could be small, so this could just be small. Oh my gosh. It's the next one. Like I said. Oh, uh, that's new, isn't it? Yes! It's a butterfly fish. Oh my gosh. That is nice to see. Uh, what do we have that we want to get rid of? Probably an anchovy. Maybe a tadpole. I feel like tadpole would sell for less because it's not a real fish. It's just like, <laughs> it's like almost a fish. Let me, real quick, check off the butterfly. Let's head out. I feel like that's good. We 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 got our four. So yeah, like I said, um, I might try to push forward. I mean, I'll push forward before next stream so that we can get to Bunny Day, and I'll try to get the cherry blossom stuff done just to get out of the way mostly. Um. Ready to go home? Um... So yeah, we'll try to get the cherry blossom stuff done. We'll do bunny day next time, which will be a lot of grind. So we'll just work away at that because that is a very grindy thing from uh, event from what I remember. Um... 
And then anytime we get bored, like, you know, I'll just keep pushing forward after Bunny Day until whatever comes first, either Nature Day or um, the other thing, the Fishing Tourney. And whichever comes first, you know, we'll do that. And then if we get bored after that, we'll just do the rest of that day. Because I don't want to do dailies too much more on stream. Like, we've done enough dailies, you know? You guys know how they go now. We have to do them at the start of a day, which is fine. But I don't want to do a day that's just fully dailies anymore. Because that's just going to be a lot of grind. Although I do love streaming Animal Crossing, but I can also just play it on my own. And I'll make little notes about what I do every day, of course. Perfect. <sighs> Sorry. Oh my gosh. Like I said, I was real tired today. I was real eepy. As they say, you know. We also do have to water the flowers. That is on my list of stuff before I end. Let's just do a big sell of everything, not that, almost everything that we got. This can be sold, blah, 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 not that. Boop, boop. Let me do a quick one run through in my head of what we've got, and I think everything is good. Let's sell. Very nice. Unfortunately, we didn't get a message in a bottle or anything. We didn't get any balloons today at all, which sucks. Very unlucky. Um, but you know, it's okay. We'll get some soon. I love how productive we are. This game always makes me feel like I do so much. this one. We want our nice watering can. Let's water these flowers real quick. And uh, I want to get a couple of screenshots uh, for the the um sorry I'm getting texted. No. Um, I want to get a couple screenshots for the what do you call it? The thumbnail? that I found kind of funny and then I'll, sh I'll show you guys and uh, we'll get that those done real quick and we'll be all good and set to head out I like doing the thumbnail in the VOD so that you guys can like <laughs> see the process I think it's funny um, I guess we'll just keep duplicating these roses I haven't been watering these, but then I guess it does make sense to water them for the sake of, like, getting... Because, you know, we do need it for decoration purposes anyway, so why not just water every flower? Let them keep spreading. Um, and then eventually we'll figure out some way to put them behind pathing or something so that they don't spread on their own, but they can just kind of sit somewhere. Or like they spread only over the section that we want them to spread to. And they can just kind of sit somewhere until we... Or like, until we build pathing around them or housing around them. Like I think we do have to start... My point is we have to start working I think on an actual structure of the island. Of what we want the island to look like in the end. The only issue is I don't know how terraforming works yet, so... Have I unlocked the ordinances yet? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> so I guess not. Because I have no idea what you're talking about. Um. No! No, no, please! I'm sorry! 
All right, let's go get the other watering can, I guess. I did not expect it to break like that. I guess I forgot they can break. Not a big fan of how much tools break in this game. Um, I feel like they could have added a little more durability, but whatever. I'm also really not a fan of the whole thing of like, oh yeah, you, um, your golden tools, they can also break. Like, come on. Be for real, bro. Be for real. Let us just keep the golden tools. That is dumb. That's dumb and you're silly for that. I feel like they should make one more update to the game. And all of all it is is golden tools now have infinite durability. That's all. Or alternatively, they just can't lose durability. I don't care. You decide. I heard of one, right? Surely this time. Surely this time I heard one. Come on now. I'm going crazy, I think. Am I going crazy? <laughs> what is happening? I thought I heard one. For sure. Oh my god. There's something wrong with me. Also, these are these things growing still? Like, they don't look like they're growing anymore. See, it's 12.15. I always see it at the time that it should be spawning. Oh, I don't know if you guys are hearing it. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm just going crazy. Was that a new bug that I just threw away? I might have accidentally just... I was, like, too focused on everything else around me. Oh, you're not supposed to run into the cherry blossom or that will also make you go away. Good to know. Like, Fanny's saying that she heard one too. Like... It's not just me, guys. It's not. I'm not crazy. I'm just a girl in the world. There is whistling. There we go. For frick's sake. My god, bro. That was really frustrating. We got it. And it wasn't a DIY recipe. Cool. I mean, it's fine. You know, I'm cool with it. I don't mind. It does suck how much I've been talking about, like, let's get those DIY recipes. And then the first balloon that we get after ages of waiting for one is not one. So that's a little unfortunate, but I'll still take it. It's still a DIY, or it's still a balloon. That's not what I meant to do. Did I get this bottom white flower? I think I didn't. I think I was just out of range, potentially. So I'm gonna just splooge it up real quick. Sewing is DIY. I guess it is. I guess you're right about that. Um. So here's the thing, right? We know it comes from the left side, so I could honestly just stand here. Oh, we gotta check turnip prices. And I gotta do that um, screenshot that I wanna take. Well, first of all, first of all, first of all, first of all, is this a new butterfly? It is! Madagascan Sunset Moth. I knew that. I knew it. I knew it! Okay, so that was the first thing. Second thing, what I want to do... I want to do... No, not that one. We're trying to find the right thing to use. Hmm... Maybe it is that one. Maybe the best one to use is this one. Okay. That's all we want. You will see you'll see the vibes when we uh when you see the VOD um thumbnail. Well, I don't know why I came here. This is not where I went I meant to go. I meant to go to the nooks area. I wanna to talk to Isabel. What if you had a room in your house filled only with sea basses and black basses, like a mini? Why would I do that? 
Fanny, I feel like you're really hung up on this bass thing. <laughs> I feel like everyone hates them. It's not just me. I, I, I don't know. I think everyone hates them. They're annoying. They're frustrating. Suck to Isabel real quick. I think you guys can tell what I'm going for here with this with this screenshot and the other one. That's the thumbnail we're gonna do because I think it's funny. So yeah, we're working on increasing the population right now. I used to dislike them, but now I find them funny because of you. I get so excited when I catch one. Well, I'm glad you're enjoying them. I don't even dislike them. I feel like I don't dislike them that much. Like, I feel like I'm not that weird. I feel like I just get mildly annoyed by them. Because I get excited and it's just a bass. Which I think is very normal, actually. Let's look around a little bit for any... Any bugs? What you thinking about? What? Okay. Thank you. I guess. Oh, from her bestie! We're besties. Oh my god, and we both pulled out our net at the same time. I had a reason for it, though. You're just like a poser with your net. Like, you don't have a reason for it, you know? Poser! Loser! So what I'm tempted to do right now is potentially just leave Animal Crossing on after stream ends and just let balloons fly and see if I can get a couple. I don't know why I did assess fossils, that's not what I meant to do. There you go. Nope. There we go. Okay. I guess we'll stand here. Looking off into the sunset. That's what I do, baby. That's gonna be, uh, that's probably gonna be where I end it. I, I don't know how long I'll go, uh, balloon hunting for, but I think I'll do it for at least a little bit of time, because, um, I feel like it would be fun. Fun to get a couple more while I, while I work, while I just get some homework and stuff done. Um, I can just look out for any balloons and see what, see what I'm seeing, you know? Um, Because I'll be sitting here anyway, so why not just have it open? So, VOD, thank you so much for watching. Before I end, let me just throw this out there. If you've watched this long, either on live <laughs> or on VOD, I have a Discord. It's in chat in the live. It's in my description or in my, yeah, in the video description in the VOD. I told you I was getting better at promotion. I'm going to try. So join the Discord if that's what you feel like doing. Um... That's where I put all of my stuff, all of my announcements, everything, stream schedule changes, literally anything. I'll try to, you know, I'll try, I try to keep up to date on there. So if that's your vibe, join the Discord. Anyway, Vod, thank you so much for watching. Take care. Much love. Goodbye, YouTube.